everyone welcome to the channel i'm scott with 1t and we're back again today with our let's play series of horizon zero dawn if you're new to the channel do me a favor hit that like button subscribe and leave me a comment down below it really helps support the channel and you can also follow me on instagram and twitter at scott with 1t for all my updates on when we drop my content so again we're, we're back at it we're looking to keep going through this uh this series to try to get it wrapped up uh forbidden west just came out so and I really am looking forward to playing that, but I haven't played this game. So it was always on my list, but I never got to it. So now kind of want to get through uh, this series so we can take a take a look at uh, first, uh, I think, a first really true next gen title, even though it's, you know, cross gen at the it still looks really, look really impressive. For what I've seen, I haven't seen too much of it, but what I have seen, I've been impressed. So with that, we're just going to jump right on in. We're on our way heading to Meridian. Did a lot of side quests last episode. Got some uh, upgrades to our pouches and whatnot. One thing I do want to get or try to get is, uh, I think I have to get Fox skin so that I can trade it that merchant so we can get unlimited fast travel because i think that will be very vital for allowing us to get places very fast i'm kind of being a little sacred land i need you know, to find olin and not stingy but just a little who the killers were how they saw me through his focus who the woman is sorry she's talking one who looks like me why they want me dead. Olin's trail leads to Meridian. When I catch him, he will talk. And he will pay for all the lives he's ruined. Yeah, so I'm, I just don't want to... I just want to keep an eye on, like, how much I'm using my... my fast travel. But once we... Get that unlimited one won't need to worry about it so i'll fast travel pretty much everywhere i can unless it's a short little walk i won't but all right walking down this cliff We're about the journey into the new land That was a cool landing. And it's just quiet. You just hear her feet. Isn't there usually like music or something playing? There we go. So we're gonna head up there. Maybe there's new animals up here. I doubt it, but one can hope. What the heck? By the sun, are you Nora? I've never seen one at a hunting grounds before or at the hunter's lodge. How interesting. What do you do here? This is a place to test yourself against a herd of machines in the stamina trials. Think you can handle it? I know I can. Excellent. Ooh. I like your spirit. You're awfully friendly. Well, you know, it gets lonely in the wilds after a few weeks. Terribly lonely, in fact. 
What about your friend over there? Oh, he doesn't count. Barely ever opens his mouth, and when he does, nothing interesting comes out. <laughs> what are the trials? The Hunter's Lodge makes sure hunting grounds around the world offer hunters a place to train. The trials here focus on the most important part of hunting, keeping your stamina up. Hunting isn't a sprint, it's a gauntlet. So all you offer is training? And a herd of machines. <laughs> Plus, I'm allowed to award marks. Half sun, full sun, and blazing sun, if you do well. Which trial looks interesting to you? I'll tell you how it's done. The remains the of watchers rest on three rises. Loot all of them before time runs out, and you pass. It sounds simple, but watch out for all the other machines down there. Good choice. Slide down a rope and I'll start timing. Are they moving? Eye down. I don't think that's what I'm doing though. I have no high down tramplers. Using rope caster. Pace trial. Race Flint Hawks to watch your course, please. A minute thirty? How in the world? Failed. Okay, I can just cancel that. What do you want to do instead? The remains of watchers rest on free rises. Loot all of them before time runs out. It sounds simple. But Good. Now slide down a rope to get started. Go, go, go! <laughs> These ones are close together. Bad day for one of us.
skipping this. We're just going to move forward. Like, I don't understand. Like, it wouldn't let me pick up the freaking... The, the, it wouldn't let me loot for whatever reason. Oh, they want me to try it again. Alright, try it again. Thing's huge. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Freaking trying. Perfection. Only this blazing sun will suffice. Cool. No, that's it. I have to get going. Different right now. Know where to find me. I don't want to spend too much time. You know. Doing, doing all these. So, I only got two. But. I don't want to save up for this double shot. Alright, so. Just keep chugging away. I'm running the wrong way. Yep. What's up, bro? Hardy little plant. You'll help. Oh, is this Meridian already right here? Oh, no, it's not. I don't think I need the auto save. I think I'm in the clear. I get it, but whatever. Oh, I just ran off the cliff. Horns.
Never mind, that's a far freaking trip. Ooh. Let's just go to this long neck over here. We'll do that. I believe that gives me access to override animals in the area, I believe. And I think it like opens up the map, like shows more. Maybe if it's naked, but I'm pretty sure that's what it said it when I did the I'm first one. Up another signal. There it is. That must be the tall neck sending a signal. It's like a drastically different crate and kiss her. Cross the water and go up that way, though. There's so many of them. Electrocute them. I just want to know if I can electrocute them. I know his friendly one. I'm over here.
good. Where's that big tall neck at? Oh, he's over there. Does he walk past me over on this side? Nah, you can't see me. Oh, he does. Hurry up, tall neck. I gotta get out of here. Ooh. All right. Now I just have to reach its head. is this thing? All this map is opened. Kind of want to go down here. But I think that's a far, far trip. So, I'll repel down. how you do it. That is how you do it. Is that a fish? Oh. Yeah, I got off the ride at the wrong spot. Metal flower.
Let's see what this metal flower is all about. I thought that was like a thought. This dude's just chilling. Oh. Oh. What the heck was this? And it's just chilling out here? Blue. Watch your heart. Nice. I feel like this is a oh into a bandit thing. Fine, we'll take it out. She said we're under attack and I jumped on her neck. Out something. Ah, ah, Need this. Put them out.
to rain down some Whoa. pain. Nice. There we go. Didn't take long. It's kind of just rain up in there. Dang. Got 10,000 XP for that? 10,000 10, XP plus all the... All that XP that I got from just taking everybody out. Things grow more dangerous. Can't I can't turn down shards. I wonder if I can craft a larger ocean sack thing. No. Outfits, modifications, potions, fishbone. Yeah. Fishbone. I kind of feel like I should just get this all today. Less of a crafting thing I need to do. Alright, level four, so we can do. Strike from below. Disarm traps. Ammo crafter. Craft more ammo per resource. Requires heavy lifter. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. In order to do this, I have to get heavy lifter. I'll rather just get this then. And then we'll get Heavy Lifter next. So that we can get this. Oh man. Oops. Crap, I don't need that. Never know when I might need these. Hope you're well. Oh, we didn't have like a person to talk to hope you're well I, I could talk to somebody here really I can't talk to no one okay what does she's got Great, I guess. Oh, that's cool. Pop it. Need a long leg heart. This had three. What we get? How many weapons you got? A watch your heart. I just don't have enough shards. All right. Not bad. The ceasefire is good, but will it lead to peace? That's how long will it go on? I'm all turned around. How do I get out of here? Hope I don't okay. burn in the sun again. Could be Please keep. There we go. doesn't my it wouldn't let me do my scan hmm. Hmm. 
Looks like I'm clear. Okay, we're almost to the Meridian. You walked What's right into that girl? girl. Scared? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. You're done. You're done. And you're done. What's up? What's up? Yeah, no one of this. I had a feeling someone was gonna have it too, because she was just like, oh yeah. No one's I I made it, no one's here, or whatever she said. Great, we got sandstorms. Crazy if it like lowered your health. Funny. that up later. We're almost there. Oh, wow. That is impressive. If you're lost, I'm a guard. <laughs> wow. It's like a paradise type city. So I'm sorry for the wait, but all goods entering the city are subject to search. This is outrageous. We're loyal citizens. I like to pace myself. This is outrageous. We're loyal citizens. How long do we have to wait? What am I supposed to do? Just sit here and let everything spoil? Uh, no, I'm awake and alert. <laughs> I thought Meridian was open to all, Karja. What happened to Ursa has nothing to do with us. What's going on? And so is Aaron, that other outlander I talked to the night before the proving. Aaron said he'd introduce me to his sister if I visited Meridian. Said she was captain of the Vanguard. It must be always in the mines. The city's locked down. Not getting through, outlander. All right. Hold. Stop right there. 
In light of the recent attack, no stranger passes into Meridian without submitting to search. Recent attack? What are you talking about? The murder of Captain Ursa and her vanguards, of course. Ambushed by Shadow Carja forces in Redridge Pass. Ursa? You mean Erend's sister is dead? How would you know his name? I know Erend. Summon him. I need to speak to him. Ha! Huh. I doubt that Erend, the new captain of the Vanguard, a man in grief, is going to waste his time on a grimy outlander. Aloy! Hey, you're alive! I thought you were dead! Make way! Make way! All the way to Meridian, just to see me? Have you been drinking? Ah, not really. A little. So, you're alive. This, uh, we should celebrate. It drinks on me. We need to talk alone, and you need to pull together. Over there. So you approve? Of course I approve. From now on, she may come and go from this city as she pleases. As you wish, sir. There. Alone as you asked. And what did you want to tell me? I heard what happened to Ursa. I'm sorry. I know she was special to you. Special to me? <laughs> special to everyone. She always knew what to do. She bossed everyone around. She kept me in line. But now I'm supposed to fill her shoes. And instead, here I am, stumbling around in them. I, uh... I lost someone, too. At the Proving, the man who raised me. His name was Ross. That's terrible. Why is it every time something terrible happens, everyone else tells you the worst thing that ever happened to them, as though that makes it easier? Yeah, why is that? Anyway, there was something you wanted to tell me? A lot has happened since we last spoke. The Proving was attacked by a group of killers. Not many of us survived. We were in the village when we heard explosions up on the mountain. Some of your braves came back, said most of the contestants were dead. I've never heard such a wail of grief as the sound that rose up from your people. How did you survive? How I survived is less important than how I was targeted. Targeted? What do you mean? The killers came for me because of Owen. What are you talking about? That doesn't make sense. I need to find Owen. I need to know what he knows. But he's a friend. No, he's a traitor. I don't know who the killers are or what they want, but I do know that Owen is working with them. But, I mean, <laughs> this... I don't need you to understand, Erend. I just need you to take me to him. He's not here. He went scrounging for scrap and relics days ago. It could be anywhere. Are there any places he frequents? Places he returns to? A house. Here in Meridian. Okay, then take me there. I need to search it. I guess. As long as I'm there to witness the search. I need to see Olin's place. Now. Okay, okay. Come on. I guess we're just not doing the other one. So many people here all talking at once. How does anyone think? I don't. I just drink. Uh. I suck that his sister died. I mean, I thought she was. I thought she died when he was telling the one story, but then she was like, "No, she lived." And then, apparently, they're letting anyone. You know, you get here to see her, and then he's dead. Your foot is through the floor. Marching over there. How long will Avad hide in his palace? Year after year, why does he spare those who enslaved and tortured and butchered? Erend, you should want vengeance more than anyone. Your own sister, murdered, and her death, unavenged? One more word, you scorched out slag, and I'll throw you in jail myself. Now get out of here, or I'll give you all a kick in the ass. 
What did he mean about Ursa's murder? Not now. The heck was he looking at? His neck was bent back. Come on, man. Walk a little faster. Okay, how are we gonna get in? <laughs> oh, that was subtle. Here we are, trying not to break anything. That other than the door. All of this for one man. It pays to have connections in the Sun King's court. The corner of this rug is frayed. The floor near it is what let's see what's underneath. Hey, how did that get here? Question is, how to get through it. Without a key, you won't. That's a vault hatch of Azaram make. Nothing gets through. We'll see about that. Of Owen's family. I think you're getting through that hatch. Did Olin ever invite you in? Nah. Closest I got was a doorstep to help him home after a night out. We drank a river that night, but I hold it well. Y usually. Are you sure you're okay? I'm sober enough, all right? I don't need another lecture. That's not what I meant. I was talking about what happened outside, with the crowd. I don't want to talk about that. We're here because of what you said about Olin, so do what you need to do. You said Olin has connections in the royal court. Does he know the Sun King personally? No. He served the court as a scout sometimes and sold ancient trinkets to nobles, but he never had an audience with the king. If you're right, and Olin's into something dark, Sun King Avad has nothing to do with it. I'd stake my life on that. I'll look around. That's what we came for. Don't gotta be a jerk, buddy. Big and heavy. Let's give it a little push. <laughs> I did say not to break anything, didn't I?
They took his wife and child captive. They? Who's they? The killers. They told him to obey or they'd kill his family. Looks like Olin kept a journal. Olin? I knew he could read contracts, but I never took him for a poet. No doubt now. Olin knew I was targeted. The glyphs show places he visited. There's your proof. Read the last page. He writes about meeting me and the order to kill me. He called himself a friend. That backstabbing cheat. How did you learn to read glyphs? And these things that you see, how do you do it? The focus. It reveals the unseen. And Olin's focus. It's the same? The device is the same, but somehow Olin and the killers can speak to each other with their focuses over distances and see through each other's focuses, too, like looking through each other's eyes. So that's how the killers saw you? Through Olin? Yes, so far as I can tell. Now that I know where to find Olin, I should be on my way. All by yourself? Leave it to me. I'm faster on my own. Wait. If that device lets you see the unseen... Out of the way, Erend. I'm asking you to help me, Aloy. I need to know who killed Ursa. Not just the, the Shadow Karja army, I know that. But the exact soldiers who did it. I'm sorry about your sister, but that's your war, not mine. Don't act like this isn't personal. You came here hunting the people who nearly killed you, who massacred your people. Why should you have justice and not me? Got a point, Look, Aloy. I'll head for Redridge Pass, where Ursa's body was found, and wait for you there. A few minutes of your focus is all I need. Don't make me beg. Redridge Pass, you said. I'll see what I can do. All right. Cool. Now, to do the other one. The big freaking city. Smells like nothing I've ever smelled before. Not stopping when you're in the thick of it. Some kind of spice. Missions we can do in here too. All right. You need to win three half suns at our hunting grounds to gain admittance to the lodge. You mean these? Very well then. Smile Congratulations and welcome. Our members reap rewards and adventure and live on in legend. Am I a member now? No, you're only a fledgling. Junior members are called thrushes. To join and become a thrush, you need a senior member called a hawk to sponsor you. So I need to find a hawk? Yes, but a hawk can only sponsor one hunter at a time, and I'm afraid most of them already have one. I've overcome worse odds. Where do I start? Upstairs. Present yourself to the sun hawk Assis, our leader, who should introduce you to a hawk. I hope it's worth it. What do you mean? You'll see. <laughs> oh, this is cool. I'll help you in a second. Whoa, it disappeared. Excuse us. Ah, 
The machine rider graces us with her presence. You're Anora, are you not? A fighter from the Savage Lands. The Sacred Land, but yes. I fought for everything I got. Huh. Tell me, do the Nora often wander into other people's homes and do whatever they like? Of course not. But that is what you're doing, right now. Stinking up our lodge, pestering your betters. You're hardly my better. Legan said I had to meet you to become a member. That would be true if there were any chance of you becoming a member. But you're a savage. And no savage will rise in the ranks of the Hunter's Lodge while I am the Sun Hawk. Now be gone. No. I was led to believe there are rules here. If they count for nothing, then even your position is meaningless. So quit blustering Ooh. and tell me. Is there a hawk who is free to sponsor me? Very well. Talana is free. <laughs> Wouldn't that be fitting? Trash sponsoring trash. Now get out of my sight. Jeez. What a jerk. You're Talana? Bessie said you were a hawk without a fledgling to sponsor. Or are you trying to drive me off too? It's okay, I've dealt with worse. Hmm. I'll bet you have. But you're wrong. It's not okay. Especially not today. What happened today? One of our own just died fighting Red Maw. You'll never face a more dangerous Thunderjaw. Cuts through trees, rocks, people. I'm sorry to hear that. It's part of the hunt. Assis, what's his story? He's the Sunhawk of the Lodge. The highest ranking asshole. <laughs> sorry, member. He's taken down Ravagers, Stalkers, Behemoths. So? I've taken down a lot of machines. As have I. Even brought down two Stormbirds. But he's a hawk who brought in the trophies first. And that's how it works. Whichever hawk defeats the greatest machine first becomes a sun hawk. How does one become a hawk? When a hawk dies, his thrush is promoted in his place, no matter how anyone feels about it. Dang. Is there any actual hunting in this lodge? So far, it's been all talk. <laughs> yes, of course. You fight a machine, then bring its trophy to assist the sun hawk, then no one can deny you brought it down. Who is this Legan, the man at the door? Legan? He's a hawk. He had an impressive run in his day, but he doesn't fight anymore. He supports the lodge in other ways. Unlike the other hawks, who hoard all the best kills and drink the bar dry. I'm ready to hunt, so tell me. What do I have to do? You want them to regret looking down on you? Then speak to them in their language. Kill three sawtooths, two ravagers, and a stalker. Deliver their trophies directly to Assis. That should shut them all up. So if I do that, you'll sponsor me? I'll consider it. Just to make Assis boil. Alright, cool. By the sun! King of Odd's edict really is taking effect. Never thought I'd see a Nora here and a woman at that. So, you have marks for me? What do you mean? From the hunting grounds. Oh, right. You're new here. What do you want with my marks? You hunters and your badges. I'm not gonna take them. I'm going to give you a weapon that sets you apart. Yeah, I thought that'd get your attention. If you earn marks in all three trials at each of the five hunting grounds, come to me. I can give you up to three weapons, one for 15 half-suns, one for 15 full-suns, and one you'll love for all blazing suns. Nice. Are you a member? Me? No. Karja don't exactly encourage their daughters to run around hunting machines. But all the changes in Meridian have been good to me. I don't think the Osirai know how to sell to us Karja. The trader I worked for last couldn't sell flowers to a bee. He was too plain hammered, as they like to say. This is a much better job. I figure I'll be able to open my own shop soon enough. 
What edict? King Avad insisted that the Hunter's Lodge had to welcome everyone. Man, woman, outlander, regardless of tribe. Ursa, the captain of the Vanguard, came in and delivered that news personally. You should have been there. It was glorious. But I figured they would sweep it under the rug and say no woman or outlander qualified. Yet here you are. Nice. What do I do with these marks? If you get the same mark from all the hunting ground trials, I can give you a Hunter's Lodge weapon. Show me what marks you've earned, and we'll see if you qualify for one of these special weapons I have for you. I'm a little short on marks. No problem. Once you have marks from all 15 trials, you'll be able to get the next Hunter's Lodge weapon from me. Alright. Merchants. I believe there's a machine parts market near the Nobel. Is singing going on? about a little over our mark so this would be a good place to wrap up today's episode if you stuck around i appreciate it do me a favor hit that like button and subscribe and leave me a comment down below you can also follow me on instagram and twitter at scott with one t for all my updates when i'm going to be dropping my content uh, so we got a lot done this episode made it to meridian finally got a bunch of new quests main quests and side quests to do got to the hunter's lodge so next episode, I think we're going to take out some of those. Uh, we're going to do the one side quest with that guy. I already forgot his name. And possibly do some of those uh, Hunter Lodge quests. Get some of those kills. And if we have enough time, we'll probably go further into the main story and hunt down Olan. That's his name. So. All right. Well, with that, everyone, have a good rest of your day. And I'll catch you all next time. See you.